I got the proposition to do the adaptation of Albert Camus, Les Possédés, what is a, a theatrical version of uh, the novel of Dostoevsky. Uh, and uh, I read it and I was not happy because I understood very quickly that this uh, novel who, uh, with 950 pages um, needs a s different kind of adaptation. It needs a uh, time to get it in his, uh, to get uh, in, in, in the grip of the really uh, important things of the novel. And therefore I uh, asked for to have the possibility to any kind of limits, time limits to exclude that. And so at the end it came out that I made my version and um, trying to retell the novel with theatrical means, as we call that. The title is make, doesn't make a reference to people who are acting in the, in the novel, absolutely not. The original, the title is very short, it's called Bez. And Bez means evil spirit. So, and the, th and the, the title means, makes reference to these evil spirits, to these demons who are in there, not devils. Now, the devil, the devil is too big. These are emanations of the devil the evil spirits, and, um, and so this is the title. The fascination from my side came by uh, reading the novel and understanding that uh, the author, um, Dostoevsky, in a very uh, ironic and very uh, precise way, um, described uh, the transition from you know, from losing the security of a kind of any kind of uh, religious security into a kind of su substituting this kind of sub security by ideo ideology. But this is not the only thing. The next step, what uh, um, Dostoevsky did and what fascinated me enormously, is not only that he uh, knew beforehand when this romance was so created around in the, in the 70s of the 9th century, uh, what happened then later with uh, under, under uh, Lenin and Stalin in Russia, but that he also uh, went one step further. He describes in this novel also the dangers of the next step after the, the ideologies. So we had in the 20th century uh, the coming up of the ide ideologies and the collapse of the ide ide ideologies. But what is our problem? And this is also described in this novel, and this for me is the wonderful thing. That means that in the person of Stavrogin, who is somebody who says, I would like to be an anarchist, a revolutionary, I don't know what, but I can't. Because for me it's everything equal. I'm totally indifferent. And this is what menaces our society and our cultural life today, is this enormous, uh, 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 this enormous problem of in indifference and the total absence of any kind of hierarchy. The hierarchy of the ideology substituted the hier hierarchy of the, of the religion by introducing the hierarchy of a party, creating, you know, Führer, Leader, or something like that. But <coughs> now the problem is that any kind of hierarchy is totally away, and you can do everything. You can today this, today become today religious, you can be anti religious, you can be Buddhist, you can do everything what you want. You can be terrorist or then something else. And so, this kind of uh, that I inside the, 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 the human being, nothing remains anymore who can, uh, can have a feeling of any kind of value or anything like this. This is the big madness that we have today. And this is described also in this uh, novel, and we, mm, we try to, to give this also in our show.